and farms and it's August and we're going to combine corn. No, but anyway, we're in our 1440 International Combine and I'm installing a new Midland radio that I got from Midland. Uh, I got two of these, so one's going in this 1440 and the other one is hopefully going in the 1460. Here we actually didn't even have to use this drill. I thought I was going to have to make holes, but there's a screw there that's mounting this yield loss monitor and there's some all along here there's one right there too and there's one here where I mounted this bracket so I mean it it's perfect I just took a screw out up here or mounting the holder there and that works now the fun part is I have to figure out this wiring so I was hoping just to run it into here somewhere but I don't know if I can run it in there anywhere I don't want to break anything. So if any of you that watch this video can tell me, this has to be a ground, so I mean that could be grounded right, right up there, this right here. And then there's a red wire here, if I can grab it, okay here, and this is a positive, this, this could go to the positive terminal, terminal on the uh, battery, but it's so much closer to go right here, but I don't know. I I don't know if I can go anywhere in there. So any of you that watch in the video, just let me know. And big shout out to Midland for sending me the products. I got some of the handheld two-way radios as well that will go in probably the uh, wagon, tra wagon tractors and the four-wheel drive, I suppose. So that's one project we're getting done. I mounted the antenna out there on the mirror. I think that should be high enough. It's not on the highest point, but it's better than I thought it was. Try that. It's better than drilling holes up there to mount it. So I'm going to try that. Um, if it doesn't work, that's really easy to move. So yeah, and another project in this thing is a cab kit. It's uh, right there. I can't see it's dirty. I uh, can't see out there either. But there's a cab kit down there for up in here. See, we were taking it out. It started to fall down last fall for back there. So we want to make it look nice. Um, another thing that's going on is that wagon. We took an extension off the top. And we're going to coat the inside with, uh, it's like Easy Slide or something is the brand. Um, I'm going to put cracked corn in there hopefully. And if we put that in there, hopefully it'll run out better. We'll try that. That's all that's going on between this. A little odd and odds and ends and hay. So, yeah. That's about it. Just again, if anyone knows about this fuse box here in the 1440 Combine, if I can put this positive cable anywhere in there, please let me know. Thanks. Thanks for watching.